Welcome to ACMA TV. Now checking the weather before you head out is one of the most crucial things you can do to keep your crew safe. Weather conditions can and do change quickly and that can put you and your passengers in a life threatening situation. That's exactly right. Now anytime you're within range or marine, VHF radio is the very best way to get the most up to date weather information. Just keep an ear out for any warnings such as gale or storm warnings, you don't want to be caught out in those. Most weather information provided by state and territory authorities is broadcast on channel 67 on the VHF band. That can change, however, in your local area, so it's worth checking the website for the latest information. Yes, now new software is meaning better weather forecasts for everyone. Let's see what's happening over at the Bureau. There are a number of things to consider when planning a trip. Firstly, are there any warnings current? We issue warnings when there are potentially dangerous conditions expected in the next 24 hours and it's important to check before you go and also by radio when you're out on the water. It's important to know that the wind speed and wave heights in our forecast are for the average conditions. When out to sea we see the wind and waves varying from minute to minute and that maximum wind gust or maximum wave height can be up to twice the forecast averages. Other weather conditions to watch out for include rain, fog and thunderstorms. Not only can they spoil your day, but they can be dangerous for you and your crew. For your safety when going out and coming in, it's important to be aware of your tide times and the potential for waves to be breaking dangerously in shallow water, especially near reefs, breakwaters and ocean bars. There's certain aspects of the weather that a marine forecaster is looking at more closely than others, and these are the ones that govern how dangerous or uncomfortable it is out on the water, so the wind speed and the height of the seas and the swell. The wind speed, if it's more than 15 knots, that's quite uncomfortable for small boat users. If it's more than 25 knots, it's not only uncomfortable, but it's also quite dangerous. And once we're expecting the wind to get to 25 knots, we'll issue a warning to highlight these dangerous conditions. So the other aspect, quite important to small boating users, is the height of the seas and the height of the swell and how powerful these are. Swell waves can be generated from a long way away, which means it can be perfectly sunny conditions and the wind can be calm, but you'll get a quite powerful swell wave come through, generated a couple of days ago. So as a marine forecaster, we're looking for these situations and highlighting them when, when we're expecting them to happen. We highlight those situations on the forecast with words like dangerous surf conditions, waves breaking dangerously close inshore, and close inshore means not only in the surf zone, but near river bar crossings out into the ocean as well. With the right weather forecast, you can safely plan your day, but remember, if it does take a turn for the worst, don't be afraid to call it a day. That's exactly right. And something else to bear in mind, if you're going to travel more than 25 miles offshore, it might be time to upgrade your VHF radio with an HF radio and sat phone. It is good advice, and thanks for tuning in to another episode of ACMA TV.